The temperate forests in Russia's far east are home to a mixture of wildlife from the cold tiger to the north and the warm temperate forest to the south. This is a place where species that do not normally live together live together. The Eurasian river otter is one of these animals. Living across much of the Eurasian continent in most clean freshwater rivers, these otters usually live alone, being strongly territorial towards each other. They often live sometimes in small groups or just come together to mate. They can breed at any time of year. And another inhabitant of these rivers is the grass carp. The grass carp is a herbivorous fish that eats river plants as well as algae and invertebrates out of the mud on the bottom of the river. These fish are notoriously bad pests in the US, where they've leached plague proportions after being introduced there. The red fox is another adaptable and widespread animal. They live in these forests just as they do elsewhere. They are omnivores and a wide range of food sources. The foxes, unlike in some ecosystems, are nowhere near the top of the food chain and thus avoid bigger predators. There are many, many other predatory animals in these ecosystems. animals like the moose, however, are safe from most predators. However, unlike in many other temperate forests, the great cats still prey. The largest cat on earth, the Siberian tiger, dwells in these forests. They need large populations of prey to support themselves, as this prey is very scarce in the winter. Siberian musk deer is another herbivore in these forests, living both here, down the Korean and peninsula and much further north into Siberia. These deer have large canine teeth, only the males have them, they are used for fighting each other. They also have a scent gland under the tail which is, has a strong scent. This odour of substance is used to mark their territory and has made them a target for poaching as their odour can be used in perfumes. What? Thank <laughs> you. 
is still the largest cat in the world, the Siberian tiger is also one of the rarest. Only between 450 and 550 of these impressive cats still talk the temperate forests of far eastern Russia and northeastern China. The tiger is the apex predator of its ecosystem. It hunts boar, deer, rabbits, elk, fish, birds, wolves and even bears. However, a tiger will not attack a bear bigger than itself. Such a conflict would be suicidal. Hard boar is a very successful mammal found across Eurasia. These adaptable pigs can eat almost anything. The boar have an excellent sense of smell that allows them to sniff out any of the food they need to eat. Wolves are the largest canine in this region, however they are rare here due to tiger predation. Other smaller carnivores thrive here however. The raccoon dog is a small species of canine. These omnivores that eat a wide variety of food and are found across parts of northern Eurasia, originally native to Eastern Asia. Another Another less known animal in these parts is the Siberian roe deer. These species are separate from the European roe deer and live mostly in the east of Russia. Slight differences in coloration can be used to distinguish the two species as well as the geographic location. Mountain hare is another widespread Eurasian species. They are found from all the way across eastern Russia to Scotland. These hares change their fur based on the season, thus allowing them to, cam allowing them to camouflage no matter the season. 